greetings cause families and students of the class of 2024. This is Principal Sanders wishing you great success for the upcoming school year. Um, we are very excited to have you in our Columbus Alternative High School family and we know you're excited to be here as well. We want to take this opportunity to let you know first and foremost that you're in the school where academic excellence is the standard and not the exception. Your teachers look forward to working with you in this new upcoming school year. And we ask that if you have any questions or concerns at any time while you're in the Cos family that you reach out to one of our Cos, our Cos staff members for support and assistance. Thank you and have a great day. Hi, I'm Mrs. Goodwin. I'm one of the Cos school counselors and we're really excited to have you guys next year and over the next four years. Hi guys, welcome class of 2024. I'm Megan Higgins. I'm gonna be one of your counselors next year and I can't wait to meet you guys. Welcome, my name is Dr. Milligan and I work as one of the school counselors at Columbus Alternative High School. We really look forward to seeing each and every one of our members of 2024. Okay, so first we're going to talk about humanities, one of the foundational courses at CAUSE. We'll have Ms. Foley and Ms. Thornburg tell you more about it. Welcome to the CAUSE Humanities Department. The humanities class that you'll be taking next year is actually a two credit class. It satisfies your English credit and your social studies credit. Because it is two credits, it's a little bit longer. It usually lasts for a block rather than a period, and it has two teachers in it at the same time, a literature teacher and a history teacher. Humanities is basically the study of all that man has created, history, art, literature, philosophy. It's a great course, and we're excited that you're, you'll be joining us. And now representing our science department, here is Mr. Johnston. At CAUSE, every science student will be accelerated. What this means is we do not offer physical science. Every freshman will take biology during their freshman year. This means you'll take chemistry during your sophomore year, and you'll be able to take upper level science courses your 11th and 12th grade years. Now, upper level science courses will involve anatomy, physiology, physics, AP biology, AP chem, AP physics, IB Bio HL or IB Environmental SL. So you'll be able to choose two of those your last two years here. Now there's one exception. If you were a student that was an AB Math and Science student in eighth grade, and if you took at least Math 1 or beyond your eighth grade year and did well, if you're interested in science and if you're willing to work, we do offer a course or courses called Biochem. Now what this is, is you take both biology and chemistry your freshman year. This then allows you to take those upper level science courses your 10th, 11th, and 12th grade year. So this way you could essentially take all three AP courses in science, or you can take a mix of both AP and IB courses in science your last three years here. So most of you guys don't have to worry about this. If you just want to take bio, you will be accelerated. You will have options. That's the default. But if you're high performing and willing to work, and if you've gotten math one down, feel free to get the application, which will be provided to you, or we'll tell you what the address is to get it. And you can apply for the biochem course your freshman year. And now to review some of our math opportunities, Ms. Webb. Hi everyone, my name is Ms. Webb and welcome to CAUSE. I'm the math department chair and I'm going to be sharing with you your scheduling options for your freshman year. As you might know, the district has transitioned from the integrated pathway to the traditional pathway. And so you want to pay attention to your options and here they are. This represents this year, 1920. If you took math eight as an eighth grader, then you'll take algebra one when you get to your freshman year and then transition into geometry. If you took Math 1 as an 8th grader this year, you will take Math 2 with us to finish off your integrated work, and then you'll transition to Algebra 2 your sophomore year. If you took Math 2 as an 8th grader, you will then go to Algebra 2 as a freshman, 
and then AP Statistics or Pre-Calculus as a sophomore. And then if you've taken Math 3 already as an 8th grader, you will take AP Statistics next year and then Pre-Calculus during your sophomore year. After all of these prerequisites are done, you can take advanced coursework at CAUSE, and in math, it looks like our IB program, International Baccalaureate, which you'll learn more about later. Welcome. Next, we have world languages. We have Mr. Moore from Spanish, and we have Ms. McCord from Latin. Bienvenidos al Colegio Alternativo de Columbus. My name's Mr. Moore, but most students know me as Profe. Here at CAUSE, we offer three languages, Spanish, French, and Latin. The most important thing for incoming students is to understand that you need to take our classes seriously and attend every day, participate actively, complete homework, and study outside of the classroom in order to succeed. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy your time here at CAUSE. Sawate omnes. Welcome to CAUSE. I'm Magisha McCord. I'm the Latin teacher at CAUSE the only place you will find Latin. We definitely promote taking a language every year you're here at CAUSE. Also, I want to mention there is a scholarship for CAUSE students only who take two years of Latin. It's called the Lucille Cornetet Scholarship. Um, back in the 50s, there was a Latin teacher here in Columbus City Schools who, uh, when she passed, she left money for scholarships. So every year, students get several thousand dollars in order to study. You don't have to necessarily study Latin, but you do have to go to college to get it. Thank you. Columbus Alternative High School offers various elective courses. This includes Art Survey History, Art Survey Skills, Ceramics and Sculpture, Art Painting and Drawing, Computer Graphics, Information Technology, Web Publishing, Excel, Music Survey, Skills, Music Survey History, Mixed Course 1, Mixed Course 2, Concert Band, and Orchestra. On top of the CCS graduation requirements, students will also be earning a Diploma of Distinction. This includes four English courses, four math courses, four science courses, four social studies courses, and three language courses in the same language. Ms. Webb here again to share some more information with you. This time I'm not going to be talking about math, I'm going to be talking about the advanced coursework at CAUSE. In addition to being our math department chair, I also coordinate the advanced studies programs, which are the AP program and the IB program. I'm going to share some small pieces of information with you today, and I'm also going to have a follow-up video with more detail if you're interested. So at CAUSE, we offer those two programs, and the AP program, which is, stands for Advanced Placement, these are some of the courses we offer right now, and these courses are available to sophomores, juniors, and seniors, but some of them are more appropriate at different phases of the education level. If you are interested in advancing yourself in the sciences, in math, in social studies, you want to make sure that you're thinking about these things ahead of time and kind of planning accordingly. And my other video will have a little bit more detail about how to do that. And if you're talking about the IB program, that is exclusively for juniors and seniors, but you can still start thinking about how to set yourself up to be prepared for those programs. We offer it in terms of the diploma, which would be the full coursework, you're taking all of your courses in your junior and senior year through the IB program, and you would graduate with a special diploma on top of your high school diploma. Or you can take just individual courses that add up to a total of four courses in different subjects that you prefer. So these are our two programs that we run for advanced studies. If you want to know more about any of the classes that we offer in these areas, you can go to our program of studies, tinyurl.com slash cause program of studies, and the descriptions of each course are listed there. And please watch my follow-up video as I will have some more pointed information about prerequisites and about the programs and the breakdown of them. Thanks.
Since our founding in 1978, CAUSE has allowed our upperclassmen to explore what's next through a weekly internship program, the CAUSE Internship Experience. Some of our leading partners include The Ohio State University, the State of Ohio, Columbus Metropolitan Libraries, COSI, Junior Achievement of Central Ohio, amongst others. Every year we send over 300 students to 200 unique business locations so that they can learn invaluable professional skills. We're excited to work with the class of 2024 over the next two years to better understand your interest so that you can have a great internship experience your junior and senior year. Look for ways that we're gonna help engage you with finding out where you are right now and what it is that you might like to explore as an upperclassman. Hey freshmen, why one piece of advice for you is to not let being awkward keep you from doing anything. Because all the good things about high school are gonna be talking to friends, talking to teachers, going to clubs, events, and all of those things are gonna feel really awkward when you do them for the first time. But the only other option is to not do anything, which is exactly what I did my freshman year. I was too afraid to talk to people, I was too afraid to go to events, go to clubs, and so I didn't, and so I kind of just wasted my freshman year. So don't be me. Hey class freshmen, my advice for a cause student is to make sure you give yourself enough time to not only finish your work, but to also give yourself time to relax and talk with friends. Because a balanced lifestyle isn't all just work or all just socializing, but it's a nice mix to ensure that you're healthy and you're living the life that you want. So make sure you hit this year strong, make some new friends, and make sure you get your work done. Hey guys! I'm really excited for you to be joining CAUSE. Um, my advice for a CAUSE student would be to reach out to your teachers and to really get to know them and form a relationship with them because they're really, really awesome people and they also really want to see you succeed and they'll help you along the way and get you to where you need to be. Hey guys, my name is Connor and my advice to a CAUSE student is to know what you love. Whether it's music or sports or history, whatever, Make sure that there's time in your schedule for these passions because when things get hard, they'll be able to bring you happiness and relieve your stress.